Hey guys, welcome back to the video. In this video, we're going to show you on how to make your own custom thumbnail without any program. Now, I still prefer Photoshop as it still has more items in it, but um, PicMonkey.com, which is the site I'm on now, um, still has the tools there to make your own thumbnails, your background, um, Facebook background as well. So it's 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 good for base basically anything. But if the file if the file isn't isn't big enough, I'll just go to online converter and it'll convert the size you want. And now what you want to do is you want to go to um I was meant to create a new folder but as you can see this is another thumbnail I'll just mucked around with to see what it will look like. Just go to open And now, as as you can see, you can post to Flickr, Facebook, Dropbox, and my computer. So I don't need to do any of that because I only use it for YouTube anyway. Um, now, what you want to do is go to your own, and this allows you to drop in a picture, a JP. It could be a PNG file as well, which which I do recommend. So I'm just going to type in, I mean not type in, um, put in. Let's just say. Um, Assassin's Creed. And now it will take five seconds to load in, uh, as it is a um, PNG file. Now, uh, as you can see, um, you can stretch it out, and you can put it down, and stretch it that way as well. And now. Let's just say I'm gonna put it next to. Let's just say the guy in Minecraft. And if it's too big, um, you can just lower it. Like that, and you can also turn it as well. So I'm just gonna turn it a bit, and just. Drop it down a bit. Like that. And now, if it's perfect where it is, or it's in the perfect place where it is, where you want it, just click the X button here. And it will just leave it. So, I'm just going to go to your own again, and just click, let's just say, went to this one. And I wanted to put in this one. And um, it will load again, and just say you want to muck around, ma make a funny thumbnail if it's a funny video or something, and then you just want to stretch it out, and it will just stretch it again. And if it's in the perfect place you want it, and then you'll just leave it. So press X again, and now as you can see, there's two photos in already. So if you wanted to put in a non PGN file and here's what it, what it would look like. It will look a bit like um the photo I'm about to show you. So it'll look like this one here. So this is what it will look like if it's not a PNG file. Or you'll see it's a white paper background in it. But um, with, with a PGN, um, these plot it will look like. But compared to this one, it does have that white background into it. Now, if I didn't want this one, I'll just click delete. And now it's gone. Um, but if you did like this video, like the video as it does help me make better videos. Subscribe as it does as well make me better videos as well for you guys. Um, I, I can probably do some tutorials on how to um, play Call of Duty or something as I am very good at those kind of games. And now, um, if you did like that video anyway, um, feel free to check out my uh, other videos as I do do a lot of tutorials and I'll be doing gameplay very soon. And um, please like the video and I'll see you all soon. Bye.